Hi everyone, this is an official tutorial for Scrapstone. This lesson introduces how to create smart mode tasks. Let's get started. First, open the software. You can create smart mode tasks through the input box and the button here. This input box is a shortcut to create smart mode tasks suitable for scraping data from a single URL. This button is suitable for scraping data from multiple URLs. Let's give it a demo. First, enter the URL and then click Get Started. You can see the system is automatically identifying. Once the identification is complete, the results will be displayed at the bottom of the page. The result shown here is only a preview of some data, not a final number of data. When you create a task using a shortcut, the task is placed in the group selected on the left. Next, we create a multi-URL scripting task. Click on the Start button and the new task interface will open. We need to pay attention to the fact that URLs of different structure cannot be scraped together because all URLs are scraped according to the same rules. If the URLs of different structures are put together, it will happen that some URLs can be scraped and some URLs cannot. At the top of the interface, we can switch modes. Here, we switch to smart mode. In this interface, we need to fill in the following information, including task group, task name. There are three ways to name a task, custom, use page title, and task group name number. The default name is the page title. There are three ways to input URLs. The first is manual input, which is directly enter or paste URLs in the input box. The limit on the number of URLs when manually entered is 5000. The second is a file import. There is no limit on the number of the file imported. Currently supported formats including TXT and CSV. After importing, there will be a URL preview below. Click here to choose a different file encoding format. The third is URL generator which are generally available for regular URLs. Please refer to this tutorial for the specific setting method. Here we use file import to create a task. Click create to start scraping. By default, the auto-detect result of the first URL is displayed, and the other URLs are scraped according to the rule of the first URL. You can also create tasks by clicking the New button in the taskbar and the tab bar. You can choose according to your preference. That's all for today. Thank you.